crises around the world are forcing record numbers to flee their homes and seek refuge within their own countries or across international borders and beyond. Today's crises are increasingly complex and unpredictable, with many becoming protracted. More must be done to mitigate the impacts of displacement and tackle its root causes. As solutions may not be immediately available or relevant for everyone, IOM is adopting a more progressive approach and exploring the opportunities which mobility may offer. Protracted situations where solutions to displacement have stalled are no longer exceptional but have become the norm. Conflict and natural disasters often trigger displacement, but often a combination of factors such as poor governance or scarcity of natural resources underlie these triggers. These then become barriers to resolving displacement. Displaced populations are increasingly not living in camps but in host communities with urban areas often a magnet. In seeking better access to livelihoods and safety for themselves and their families, displaced populations are increasingly mobile, moving locally or across borders. While existing durable solutions frameworks focus primarily on refugees and IDPs, IOM recognizes that crises also affect migrants and other mobile populations, as well as communities that are not displaced or that host those directly affected. IOM's approach aims to empower displaced populations, migrants and affected communities so that they can better anticipate, manage and recover from shocks and stresses. Populations will then be able to move quickly and effectively out of crisis and vulnerability and be better able to prepare for or avoid future crises. Primarily in partnership with humanitarian actors, it is important to identify and reinforce positive coping strategies and avoid interventions which may undermine such strategies or even result in the adoption of harmful practices. This is a first step towards building resilience. Together with humanitarian, development and private sector partners, individuals, households and communities must be enabled to become economically productive members of society through inclusive access to livelihoods and employment, linking needs with demands locally or across borders. Sustainably resolving displacement situations requires partnership with a wide range of development, peace and security actors to identify and address the drivers of displacement and the barriers to its resolution. Protection mechanisms must be in place, including the establishment or re-establishment of the rule of law and measures to ensure respect for human rights. Across these objectives, those affected by displacement may employ mobility strategies, which may offer opportunities towards resolving displacement, but may also entail risks which need to be mitigated. Four programmatic pillars underpin IOM's efforts to progressively resolve displacement situations. This progressive approach is translated into IOM programming structured around four core pillars. Protection, safety and security, which focuses on legal safety and physical and material security is the first pillar. Pillar 2 houses an adequate standard of living, which contributes towards sustained access to adequate food, water, housing, health services and basic education. The third pillar covers efforts to sustainably earn a living to meet daily needs and live in dignity. And the final pillar includes IOM's efforts to promote inclusive participation in the decisions and processes of public affairs. IOM has developed a framework on the progressive resolution of displacement situations. It aims to guide IOM and inform its partners in framing and navigating the complexity of forced migration dynamics. It also aims to support collaborative efforts towards achieving shared objectives. IOM's new framework outlines IOM's approach to progressively resolving displacement situations. Working in partnership, IOM seeks to maximize the opportunities mobility may offer, working to uphold the rights of those affected by displacement so they can develop the capacities they need to become more resilient. <laughs>